dog is scared of being touched, but he's developed this super cute technique so that he can still have a cuddle. We rehomed him back in April and he was a very nervous boy. At the start, we could hardly touch him at all. It's come on a lot since then, but he still finds it hard to trust us. It's so sad because he really likes a snuggle and he's a clinger at heart, so he's often feeling quite conflicted. The only time he isn't so scared is when he's under a blanket. It's like it if I can't see you, you can't see me thing. And when he's under there, he's invincible. So he uses the blanket to get closer to you and get better cuddles. He digs his way in or asks you for help. And once he's under there, he's brave enough to curl right up in your side and get some proper love like he deserves. The moral of the story is, Hang on to whatever makes you feel brave. We all need a comfort blanket sometimes. It's happening right now. <laughs> Here he goes. Um, okay, great. I think part of it is like he's overstimulated all the time. Like there's so much in his environment that he finds overwhelming. And I think when he's under there, it just sort of muffles things like the sounds, but also he can see less. And I think he's sort of struggling with overwhelm and He's a little bit suspicious of new people that he hasn't met before and, you know, all of those things are things that we all deal with. They're just like a little bit more upfront for him. I've got a difficult email to send. You'd best believe I'm doing it from my bed, like under the duvet. <laughs> That's the only way. And I think to see him kind of finding ways to move through that he's not conquering those fears but he is kind of getting there a little bit at a time and that's quite relatable too you know it's not like um it's not a huge triumph over the struggles he's going through it's like he's sort of chipping away at them you know when they make that progress that's a pretty amazing feeling and it's a real lift and you know we feel as proud of ourselves as we feel of them because we're just working so hard to create an environment that they can thrive in